Yeah, we're beauty's big sister. Check it. Hi beauties, welcome back to my beauties at Big Sister channel. I'm so happy, I've got my hair extensions back. Nice, long, thick hair. Oh, it does feel nice, I'm not gonna lie. Um, so I've got my Great Lengths Keratin Bonds back. So I went into Gilly Green to get my extensions. Um, this is the first time that I've washed them and I always find with it, when I have my extensions done, when you first wash your hair, you, it does like some of the colour comes off like in the in the bath so I feel like it's always good to give them a nice wash as soon as you can because I think they have some kind of like a, a coating on them look how good they look and look how long okay, let's go in with a little bit of heat protectant this is the Red Ken Extreme Play Safe 230 degree protection obviously I don't even need it up to that many degrees but I think the main thing where people go wrong is not treating their extensions like actual hair. That is the most important thing. Like I put treatments on my hair extensions, I go in with masks, like I do loads to protect and nourish the extensions and they'll last for so much longer. I mean, great lengths said three to four months to have these extensions in is what they recommend. Honestly, I have mine in I think for like seven, eight months. If you look after them and if you brush the hair from the roots so they don't get matted like there's so much you can do to actually look after them and then you will have them for ages so just going in with a heat protectant i'm also going to go in with the philip kingsley elasti styler uh, which is like a five in one treatment um multitasker for all hair types it pretty much does everything strengthens conditions primes tames and adds shine so Let's go in with a nice generous dollop of this as well. So I have washed my hair with the shampoo, I think that, I don't know how you pronounce it, shampoo? Not sure. Formulated for dry, difficult or damaged hair that longs for moisture. Extensions, because there's so much hair, can get quite dry. You need to constantly be like brushing and hydrating, adding oil and serum, so this kind of like hydrating formulation is great um also you need a sulfate free shampoo and conditioner so this brand is sulfate free silicone free paraben free all the goodness in this shampoo and conditioner so i have had 200 bonds uh keratin bonds i didn't actually realize that it's like a cold fusion application even though it is like pretty much glue like it's bonded to the hair here tiny little bonds you can't even really see it um I thought it was with heat and it's not so it doesn't even damage your hair when um, you're having them applied which is amazing um, and they are double drawn so the ends of the hair are just as thick as the top of the hair um, which is an amazing thing to have with the extensions and I've had a mixture um, of shades so you'll be able to see when I dry my hair the different shades coming through but it's mostly shade two and then i've got shade three and four um scattered around for the lighter bits so yeah really really happy because i never really like bleach my hair have, i've never really done highlights i've had balayage once and i really liked it but it can be quite damaging to the hair so this is a really great way of adding in some more colors to your hair without damaging your hair um so yeah i'm gonna um blow dry this now I had to do a little quick dress change <laughs> into my robe because i've washed off my fake tan because i could see that it was developing quite a bit so i've i've rinsed that off now um so now i can style my hair but yeah this is what it looks like straight oh, i haven't seen it straight yet i'm kind of loving it like you can see all the colors it looks really really cute so let's divide this up i'm nervous how long this is going to take me because it just took me ages to blow dry my hair um and i am in the world's biggest rush as always i'm running late <laughs> um i've got my mark hill pick a mix tong i think this is the long barrel honestly it's amazing it's my favorite tong to tong my hair with um so i'm excited to see what it looks like on these extensions um yeah really really quick easy to use i never burn myself because of the the way it's directed and you can get like different barrels for it as well which is really cool so 
I really want the beach waver um, for holiday, but look, it just gives a really nice, sorry, you can't actually see that with all my hair, gives a really nice natural looking wave. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and do the rest. Yeah, I will show a before and after of what my hair looked like on screen so you can see like the difference. Like I feel like a new woman with my hair. Um, it does just give me the biggest like confidence boost. Having nice long thick hair. I'm excited to see what this hair looks like with the uh, air app. I think it would look amazing so I definitely need to do that. I'm going to carry on wanding the rest of my hair because obviously I'm just doing the same thing. Um, I do it all in one direction actually because then I like to brush it through after to give me that nice like soft waved look. Um, so yeah I'm going to carry on doing this and then I will show you my hair once it's finished. This is what my hair is looking like after wanding. It actually didn't take too long. That took me 20 minutes, so I don't think that's too bad. It was the drying process, which now I realise that's why I used to wash my extensions once a week, because <laughs> it's too long. So I just normally clip up like the top bit, uh, sorry, the bottom bit, and just wash the top bit every other day, or every few days, so I don't actually wash the full extensions every time I wash my hair. That's normally once a week job. Um, because yeah, that was quite long to be honest. I'm just going in with my Percy and Reed uh, What is this the wonder treatment oil, which is really nice to go through um, And I don't think that I'm gonna put hairspray in it because it tends to keep the curl quite well um, The extension so I think I will leave that but oh, honestly, I'm just obsessed. It's so nice to have my hair back um, Let me know if you have got any questions and I will answer them in the comments. I feel like they look really natural as well, which is what I wanted. Um, and these are the 18 inches, these ones. So yeah, loving it. Hello, my beauts. Come on, Kelly. You wanna say hello? Do you want to say hello? Hello, hello, hello? Guys, she's starting to calm down a bit. Um, I actually texted Steve this morning, as I say, while she's trying to bite me. Um, I texted Steve this morning saying, I actually don't know if Callie is ill because she's just like pretty much slept all morning and we haven't had a brat attack. This is what we're calling it when um, she has her mental, mental hour. Um, it's the brat attack. She's been so chill today. So maybe this is the start. Callie. It's actually three months since I filmed that video, I think. Um, oh my god, yeah. Did I film that? I filmed that before I even got you, Bubba Girl. How crazy is that? Uh, time has whizzed by. I actually lost the memory card, which is why there's been such a uh, delay with putting this up. But actually, it might be quite good because, you know, they do say three to four months. Um, is good for the bonds as I said like in the previous clips I do keep my extensions in longer than that but this is what my hair looks like beginning of May and we're now at beginning of August um this is what it looks like I have loved having the other like colors in my hair with the lightest strands you can see there honestly I've just had no problems at all which I knew I wouldn't but they just <laughs> grow down so, so nicely. Um, I'll give you a little close-up, actually. It's typical when I've gone to film this. I've got the worst, like, bloodshot eye. Anyway, I don't know if you're going to even be able to see. You can see, yeah, a little bit there. The bonds that are now growing down. I mean, I've been able to still put my hair in ponytails, slick my hair back. That is what it's looking like. like. I said before, I'm just, you know, looking after it, brushing it through. Um, I've changed my shampoo and conditioner now. Uh, the one I'm using is, just because I run out of the shampoo one, um, the John Frieda. It's like micellar water shampoo and conditioner. It's such a good 
shampoo and conditioner for hair that gets greasy quite easily which my roots normally do um but it's like paraben free sulfate free all that jazz um and it's a really really lightweight formula that actually lathers up really well for a paraben free um i've been loving this new Sol de Janeiro, smells unbelievable, uh, milky leave-in conditioner, um, you can spray it on to um, damp hair before you blow dry it, so I've also been air wrapping my hair as well, which I do really like, but for me I actually think my hair looks best being tonged, um, so that's been my go-to, I've also done the beach waves with beach wavers now, which has been fun, but yeah, this is like my go to um i love the sol de janeiro oil but this is another one of my favorites the percy and reed shine serum um i do feel like the extensions do get quite knotty so yeah i just have to keep on making sure that there is serum or oil going through them um just to keep them nice and oh, i mean i just i love when they even grow out because then i've got even longer hair i'm just so so glad i got this in time for summer because it's so perfect on holidays because your hair just always looks good no matter what um but yeah considering i've been on two holidays it's been in chlorine it's been in the sea um you know it's still looking so so good so yeah i think it's here to stay for a little bit longer i can't see me you know changing it anytime soon because they're absolutely perfect still i am so buzzing guys i am going to see christina aguilera tonight ah honestly i'm buzzing uh i've seen her before at wembley and she was incredible um so i can't wait to see her tonight at the o2 and it's actually with her fragrance team um i feel like i had this forever ago like years and years and years ago um i didn't know it was still out it's her classic one it actually says on the front as well that it was awarded the number one celebrity brand which is a pretty cool claim rrp is 32 pounds for 50 mil but at superdrug right now you can get it for 16 pounds <laughs> Like that is mental. Whatever it smells like, I'm sure it will be nice. I definitely had this when I was younger, when I was at school. But you know like them perfumes that you just have in your car for when you just need to quit spritz or when you're going to the gym you still want to smell nice or going for a walk. You don't want to use your expensive perfumes, like 16 quid. Do you remember them? What were they from? Jane Norman? Is that what they were from? The, the bags. Do you know what I mean? They had like a corset vibe to it and a little bow this is really taking me back okay let's oh this is actually taking me back oh my gosh i used to wear this it's really nice <laughs> i really like it what um what's it got in it a bouquet of peonies and jasmine flowers enriched with creamy vanilla is sometimes all you need to wear is what it says on the back I want her to like re-update the packaging. I would love that. I think that would be really, really cool. Um, but the actual fragrance is really blooming nice. Look what they sent as well. Can you even tell? Look at this beautiful bouquet. It is absolutely huge. So yeah, guys, I'm actually so excited to go. Um, I feel like I haven't been to a concert in, you know, a while. I've been to festivals this summer, but I haven't been to a concert. On that note, I'm really sad that Shawn Mendes, I had tickets to see him this year. He postponed it until next year. And now um, he's cancelled again because he said he needs to work on his mental health, which is really, really sad. So I hope he's okay. Um, gutted that I'm not seeing him, but hopefully he'll be back. He'll be back soon, but let me know what you guys are up to. How has your week been? Have you got any concerts coming up? Is anyone else going to see Christina Aguilera? Uh, yeah, let me know in the comments. I'm so sorry it's been forever since I uploaded. Life's just been a bit manic. I've managed to keep on doing my lives, but in terms of uploads, it's just been a bit quiet. So I'm hoping that I can now stick to the schedule, stick to coming back and being consistent. So fingers crossed. I'm also trying to be a bit more consistent on TikTok if you want to follow me on there, Beauty's Big Sister. Um, but yeah, any questions about my hair, please do just ask away. Oh, I love it. Anyway, I need to get ready. I need to get changed, find an outfit, sun shining. 
It's gonna be good vibes. Uh, I hope you enjoy this video, girls, and I will see you in my next video. Bye. Give her like the glue on the lashes I'm fleet like the brows Never throwing in a towel Always ready for the town Looking beautiful together You're stronger than ever Your community don't tether Yeah, your sisters forever Girls before you missed her Be part of a team Yeah, we're beauty's big sister I said and Put your girls before you missed her Be part of a team Yeah, we're beauty's big sister Check it